this is creative academy students here in this video i will show you the concept about decimal right so before telling about decimal i want to again tell you about the fraction because decimal is the another way of representing fractional number right here i have created two box okay and divided each box equally into 10 equal parts right and i have crossed all 10 parts of this box and only three parts of this box okay as i have divided this box into 10 equal parts so as usual we write the fraction we will write 10 as denominator you know this okay right i also can write 10 denominator for this box also is it clear because i have divided this box into 10 equal parts right as i have crossed all the 10 parts of this box so i can say that numerator will be 10 that means i have taken all the 10 box small boxes from this big box is it clear and i have only crossed three small boxes in this big box so i can say that the numerator here will be 3 you know this okay now i am saying that if i want to add this two number okay that means if this 10 equal small parts and this three small parts will be added right so what we can write that means we can write in this way 10 by 10 plus 3 by 10 right so this 10 by 10 can be cancelled so it becomes 1 plus 3 by 10 now it can also be written as 1 3 by 10 these are the shortcut method you know already that means if i want to add this whole part so i can directly remove this plus and put along sides of the fractional part that means the whole part can be written along side of the fractional part in this way i think you know this okay now again i am doing wonder okay how you also know this i write whole part as it is and i write this 3 by 10 like Point three. Okay, you know this. By zero in place instead of zero, I written three, and instead of one, I written point. Okay, so this become one point three. So this can be also also written by one point three. That means this cross boxes small boxes can be written as also one point three. okay and or 10 by 10 plus 3 by 10 is it clear now this is the decimal equivalent this is the decimal equivalent of this fraction right 1 3 by 10 or we can also say that when this both will be added so it will be equal to 1.3 right in decimal part this is called decimal number right we say this as whole part and this one is the decimal point okay and this is the decimal part or fractional part 
we cannot say it fractional part because it is not a fraction so i say it decimal part is it clear now i am again rewriting the number this is also called tenth by position this is the tenth position okay and this is the one position as you know and this is the decimal number okay i am further want to illustrate you with the place value of the number to make it more clear the what is decimal and what is the whole part and you will have a complete idea about decimal number okay and further in this uh, series i will also explain you what is the importance of decimal number okay what is use of the decimal number okay